Hi, I'm David from Houston and Hawks. Um, we all know how hard our industry's been hit of late. So I'm just off uh, down to Greenwich to meet one of our suppliers, Paul Rhodes. He's a well-known figure in the industry and uh, just to have a chat with him to see what they've been going through and uh, see if we can pick up any helpful hints and tips for you. We acted very quickly and yeah. adapted and we changed, mainly listened to our customers, listen to what they want and acted upon that, you know. We dropped um, down to 15% literally in 10 days, but then we, you know, we started doing some business through caterers for um, the NHS. Yeah, uh, we picked up some retail. And we started doing our own delivery, um, and it's just really, just really working hard and making sure you deliver a good product and you know, giving the best service. You know, even even more so. Yeah. For for me as a business, uh, that um, relationship with your supplier is key. Um, yeah. It's a bit like your customer. You know, it's. I think. More so now since the pandemic, I think what I've realised is that there's that relationship has really bonded and got stronger and people, they, everybody wants to really support each other and help each other, you know, and I think that's quite special and I hope that, I hope that stays. We're all in this together, you know. We've all had a massive hit. We've had, you know, redundancies, sales have cut, you know, and it's the same for the suppliers as well, so everyone's feeling it. I think what one thing I find suppliers, they'll really go out of the way now to to make sure that you get what yeah. you want, you know, on time, and that's that's all of us, really, isn't it? I think have confidence, be confident in what you what you feel you can do. Mm. Um, be flexible. The same jobs are not going to be there. It might be even a lower salary. It might be you've got to do a type of one and a half roles, you know, and you've got to yeah. you're not doing just that job. But, you know, I don't think you should be shameful of that or you know afraid of that I think it's, yeah. it's it's a must it's a good opportunity to research and see what's out there and also I think it's a good time to test recipes and, and, and play around and plan yeah yeah don't be too ambitious at this point because things are it's the unknown I think small Small steps are sometimes, you know, the better way forward. And I think, you know, big steps you might fall over. I think just, you know, take it steady, yeah. be positive, and you know, find your way back in that way. I think that's um, the way I would do it.